Factorial is just an extension of the fundamental counting principle. So here's the idea. Factorial is going to have events, but the choices for the event are always going to come from the same place. So as we look here, I have five people, and let's say these five people are running a race, and we're trying to figure out who gets first, second, third, fourth, and fifth. So my events then are going to be that they got first place, second place, third place, fourth place, and fifth place. Those are my events. Now the choices in my event are how many people are still left. For example, in first place here, there are five people running in the race. So to get first, you have five possibilities. Now let's say the person that got first with Kathy. So now Kathy's gone. So now to get second place, there's only four people left. So there's four choices for that. Let's say that was Elena. Third place, you have three people left. So that would be three choices. Let's say that was David. Fourth place, we have two people left. Let's uh, put that down. Two people. Let's say that was Bob. And then fifth place, we have one person left. That was Alice. Okay, so now everybody's used up. We've got... Um, We've got our choices filled in, and so now we have to multiply these out. And I believe if we multiply this out, we get 120. So there's 120 ways these five people can finish a race if we're concerned about first through fifth place, and that's factorial.